it's Tuesday. And yeah, I'm out for a ride. I'm actually at the turnoff for the lake. Lake's right back there. I don't know if you can see those trucks. They're harvesting the, I'm guessing, guessing wheat. Harvesting wheat in this field here. Uh, let's see if we can see the combine out there somewhere. Anyways, there's combine, a couple of combines in that field. And those semis are waiting to pick up a load of wheat, take it to market. So, anyways, it's hot out here. It's 80, 80 up or 80s. I'd imagine it's actually warmer than that because my phone is always lighter than what the thermometer says. Although that thermometer, who knows how accurate that is. Could be the phone's right and the thermometer's wrong. I don't have a clue. I just know it's warm out here. And uh, didn't hear requires uphills. And, uh, oof, wowie. Yeah, I get the appeal of an electric bike, I really do. Um, but what you don't get with an electric bike is that never ending monotonous muscle burn that just hurts and aches and it distracts you. It just gets into your head. Um, so it takes a little bit more concentration to uh, say, you know what, I'm gonna get to the top of that hill, but that's all right. I'm in a personal growth kind of mood. I had a personal best on uh, my bike ride. Not on my bike ride, I'm gonna run this morning by a long ways. Uh, I beat my average mile time by 15 seconds. That's a pretty pretty substantial gain over two miles. So I was pretty pleased about that. Um, so anyways, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go go home now because <laughs> my legs are beat, and I still have to go home. And there's hills between here and there. So unfortunately, most of it's downhill, but there are a couple valleys that I have to cross. So I'm gonna do that. I'll be back with you guys. I mean, look at split for you, but <laughs> ouchy pain for me. So we'll see you in a couple ouches. Hey, I am home. I'm cooled off. My heart rate's still up, but that's okay. Oh, it's coming down. It's fine. Uh, did you know that your elbows can sweat? I guarantee if you were to go out and ride a bicycle up hills in almost 90 degree weather. Actually, let's go look. Let's go look and see what the thermometer says. In whatever temperature it is in hot degrees, um, your elbows too would be sweaty. Sorry for the noise of your condition, huh? Uh, let's just have a quick peek here. Yeah. It says 95. So, I don't know. I, again, I don't know how accurate those are. Um, people have been using them for years, but it's always a little bit warmer than what my phone says it is. So, there's that. But, anyways, hope you guys are doing well today. Hope you're feeling healthy. I gotta sort through dinner because it's dinner time. Um, and,. And figure out what I might eat. So I'm gonna do that. And I'm gonna drink more water. I did get a water bottle for the bike, so that was helpful today. Um, yeah, I just hope, hope you guys are having a great day today. I hope, hope you're staying cool because I know it's hot out there. Everybody at work is complaining about the heat. Rightly so. It's warmer there than it is here, unless you go by that thermometer. Um, but I'm gonna get going. So I love you guys. I'm thinking about you. Hope to see you tomorrow. Well, I will see you tomorrow. I'm not going anywhere. Um, and I hope you're doing well. Love you.